Hey, buddy. I'm Duke. Okay. Happy, we're getting closer and closer to Halloween. <laughs> I thought I would show you sort of how we do Halloween. We do give out candy. I'm sorry, I'm getting with my, my bag a minute. And we do give out candy. I think I've told you guys multiple times that we go to my sister's house. Her, uh, she lives on the corner. She gets a ton of kids. We have a huge pumpkin that we fill up every year. I'm trying to move so you guys so I can... Why don't I do this beforehand? Because it would be easier, right? Right, okay. Um, oh, guys, if you haven't seen this, Dollar Tree has color-changing lights now that we're going to put in the pumpkin. So, yeah. Okay. So, we're going to start first of all with... Mmm. What I've made this year for the hands-free kind of um, trick-or-treaters so they can pick out their stuff. So I made this out of, this is a Dollar Tree bucket. They have some really cute fall colors right now. This is some of the, again, this was Dollar Tree. This is Dollar Tree. This may not be Dollar Tree. I'm not sure. Um, let me kind of back it so you guys I'm going to be able to see the whole thing a little bit all at once. There we go, kind of all at once. Basically, it's like a witch bucket. This is the Dollar Tree, those like door handle, door witch legs, and I just cut them out. Cut them off the circle. I put them on the dowels to the plungers. And as you can see, I'll go this way, you can see the feet. I just glued them to this board that I had that I had already painted orange and black for Halloween. I've had the pumpkins for years. They were from Target Dollar Spot. This is just a, a can that I put here and some, well, just so, with some rocks so it doesn't fall down. <laughs> but that's what I'll put the candy in so the kids can just reach in and get the candy. Now, what we do, so what I thought I would do is I would show you guys. So, I like to do the teal pumpkin. I like to have things that are not all candy. So first foremost, I got these at Walmart. So I got these at Walmart in the, I, again, I call it the $5 area in our Walmart. Could be considered the dollar area. It's kind of like the Target dollar spot equivalent, but for Walmart. Not all Walmarts have it. Uh, one in our town has it, one in doesn't. Anyways, these are Halloween stickers. There's three stickers in the pack. There were 16 in them i felt it was a better deal than dollar tree since you get 16 packets and i'm just gonna go ahead and throw them in there now i will also have stuff in my big pumpkin so that when this starts to get low i can switch it up so here's stickers because sometimes you get little kid you know get the little ones it's also for kids who can't have sugar or that much sugar. We do that. Now, the other thing I do, so I'll probably get other things besides those stickers, but that's what I have right now. And as of, this is, I'm filming this on September 21st, so a Wednesday. Of course, we will get more. This is just the beginning. I did pick up at Dollar Tree the little treat bags. So there are 30 in this. So I got one, two, three, four, five bags, and so 60, 100, but this still won't be enough. I'll still have to get probably another five bags. But what I do with these, and I'm going to do, first let me do this. So I went to Dollar Tree, and I got some Dollar Tree candy. Keep in mind, though, that when you get the Dollar Tree candy, you're not getting as many. I will get more of this one for sure. I love getting these, at, these ones out every year. It's the Bloody Bites, and you only get seven in this, but it's already kind of open. I love the packaging. Look at the packaging on this. Look at that. You got a little vampire here, the little vampire right here, and then on the back, you have a little vampire girl. But I love these. I think they're just so cool to get out just these, and not just a candy bar. So we have these. So it is the little fangs with some jelly blood, I guess you'd call it. 
I'll throw those in. I will probably get more of these, like I said. Yeah. Throw those in. Open this one up. I just think these are cool to give out other than just candy bars, but that's just me. <laughs> My sister, she gets the can, you know, you gotta have your, your Kit Kats and all that. I like the silly stuff. So the blood, though, let me just see. The blood is sugar, high fructose corn syrup, water, citric acid, red 40. Ooh. Hmm. I'm just thinking children that might be allergic to the red dye. Uh, so hard now, huh? Doing trick-or-treating. I also got a package of, and I'm going to get more of these. The Warheads Oozy Chewies, individually wrapped pieces. So there's 16 pieces in here, and it comes in sour, chewy candy filled with ooze. And does it give the flavors? It just says fruity flavors. It doesn't. Oh, here we go. Mango, strawberry, green apple, black cherry, watermelon, blueberry. And you get 16. Now, if you don't have a lot of, like I said, a lot, if you don't need to get a lot of candy, you have a few kids that come go to Dollar Tree I and mean, this is name brand candy it's just you know comes in these little they're individually packaged so that's good so here's the warheads now I cannot after I put all this in here for you guys I will be taking it all out because Sabrina and Jeremy will eat it if I leave it all in here <laughs> another reason why I think I'm going to start doing my bags now okay I also got a Dollar Tree Dots. Now this only has, this is one of my favorite Halloween candies. I only allow myself to have dots at Halloween. So get a bag of dots. You don't get very many. I got a bag of dots. I love dots. But you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You only get eight. So, you know. You only get it. I got that in there. I also picked up, there's 12, the mini airhead bars. You get 12. And I know that the kids love these because every time I go to a basketball game, this is what they get. So you get 12, you get the strawberry, you get the watermelon, and you get the mystery, the white mystery one. I even love airheads. So I'll throw those in there. I'm just testing it to see if she's going to stand, okay? And then the last one I got, I like these from Dollar Tree. This is a different, I have not seen these are, they're like a blow pop, but they're called Bon Bon, Bon Bon Bum, Bon 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 Bum. And it's watermelon, blue raspberry, and strawberry all together. You get 18 in this. They've had in the past, and I hope they get it in between now and Halloween. They've had ones that were black, so when you, your tongue turned black. Okay. So she's doing pretty good. That's good. Okay. But what I normally would do, like I said, I've got that. Let's take a peek inside. So that holds a lot. That does hold a lot right there. And so that is going to be our hands-free candy but now what we do like i said we don't just throw the candy in there have the kids dig around for the candy we take one of the bags we take a bag i'm not going to open it now but we take a bag i will put a lollipop and a piece of chocolate normally or i'll take some of the non-candy such as the stickers Let's see I'm going to have to figure out how to get her. See, if she sits this way, she's good. We'll see. <laughs> or I'll take like a non-candy, like a stickers. Or I've done spider rings in the past. I've done pencils. We've done all kinds of things. I've been at Dollar General and seen little keychains that were on clearance of different characters like Minnie Mouse, Mickey, whatever. And I've thrown them in there. It's teal pumpkin, if you don't really know what it is. It's basically... 
You're supposed to put a teal pumpkin out, which I have, which I'll put right here next to her. Not a lot of people realize it, but if you have a teal pumpkin, that lets moms and dads know that you do have alternative to candy so that the children they said we can't have the candy we have allergic allergies issues they can go ahead and and there's other choices for them i've never had a child want you know some of the children they want this other choice and they'll take it other parents they don't i think it's just our town is big on halloween kids come they have a blast um so that's what i do we will take these on halloween i try to do it before if i don't get it all done before with my niece Kat, Sabrina, my sister, I, we sit in the house and we fill these up so that on Halloween night, all the kids need to do is grab a bag. I wish the bags were not see-through though, because sometimes the kids will dig looking to see what's in the bag, but you know, it's, it's fun. So yeah, guys, I wanted to show you what we do, kind of my little haul, can, Dollar Tree candy haul. As I stated, I will be getting more, see, she is leaning. <laughs> So I'm glad I'm doing this now because I want to see. I'm just testing her out. So I do want to, I will get more um, of the, probably the Airheads and the Sour, what were they? The Warheads. I'm getting the Warheads. Because you get 16 pieces and that's not bad. 16 pieces and 12 of the air of the mini Airheads. So I'll probably get more of these throughout the, the month. And then... Every time I go to Walmart, I try to pick up a bag of chocolate there, too. And normally, chocolate-wise, we try to do Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. And you yeah, we get the mixture with the Twix, the Reese's. I know the Twix and the Reese's aren't together. The same one aren't together. But that is what we do for our trick-or-treaters. We try to do a little bit of candy and a little bit of non-traditional, non-candy. So... So guys, uh, as I stated, we will be doing more non-candy stuff right now because of stickers. I'll get some other little, little things. I hope you're having a great day. I hope this gives you some ideas for Halloween for your trick-or-treaters. If you don't, like I said, if you just have a, a neighbor, you don't get a lot of kids, check out the Dollar Tree candy. Um, the only ones I really don't get are the, they got the little packages like, it reminds me when I was little of the candy cigarettes, like the candy sticks. I don't get those. So, guys, that's, uh, I hope this helps you. Like I said, I hope it gives you some ideas. Thank you so much for subscribing. It's free, guys. Push that button. If you like my videos or if you like our videos, push that button. If you don't like our videos, push that button. Let us know. Give us feedback. Put a comment. Let us know what we can do. I know I talk fast. I talk with my hands. I, I always tell people, one, I'm Jewish. Two, I'm a Gemini. Three, I was born in New York and raised in Los Angeles. Now I live in Tennessee. So I talk with my hands. I'm an original Valley girl. If you're from the 80s, you know. Anyways, guys, like. It's free. Subscribe. It's free. Don't like. That's free, too. Make a comment. It's free. It's all free. Love you all. Thank you so much for everything. Be kind to yourself. Be kind to others. Happy spooky season. And I'm going to blow it on out for you guys. Thank you so much. We'll see you on the flip side. Bye, guys. And one, two, three. Blow it out.